Hey, Kermit here. Uh, we're going to run this off with Pup, or we're going to try to anyway. This airplane got crunched in Hurricane Andrew, and since that time, we brought it back. Spent a lot of time res restoring the airplane, put some uh, fabric on it, tweaked a few things, painted it up in uh, pretty cool colors. went through our inspection with the DAR and he had the FAA uh, in tow uh, with him. So, uh, so we went through the inspection process of looking the airplane over. Uh, we did our weight and balance. We weighed the airplane. It came in very good weight wise. Uh, we're actually a few pounds lighter than an original pup and that's probably because we don't have an original uh, you know, heavy machine gun on the airplane, so we're right where we're supposed to be, ready to do taxi tests and run the engine and whatnot. So that's where we are. We haven't heard an 80 Lerone run around here in ever. So let's see what it does. The tail to go on one of the tie downs right there. So hang out a right. Okay, three. Down. That just seems, seems like it's sitting high. Ken built the double scale. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is uncomfortable as crap. <laughs> okay, so all I've got is a mag switch, a blip switch, the fuel, and the tamp. The fuel shut off valve? Yeah. Okay. okay, I already have a problem. So that's the problem. Yeah, the, the fabric's rubbing. Whatever, as long as I know it's there. Okay, so it's tied down, we got chalks, right? Yeah. <laughs> Try not to embarrass yourself, man. Okay, you ready for fuel on? Fuel on. Okay, the fuel is on, and I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up, so go ahead and just pull it through, I think, till it leaks. Oh, that's good. And, uh, you know, so you want to just try it? I'll give it a spin. Okay, so wait a second. Let me go first. All right, well, just get, get, give it a shot. It, it's hot. All right, here you go. Switch off. Switch those off. Switch on. It's on. It's off. It's off. 
Well, I tell you what, let, let, let's do like what uh, Andy was saying. Let's turn the fuel on and everything says off. Go ahead and just su pull it through really quick. I got okay. fuel open. You got the uh, label now hooked up. Yeah. Okay, okay let's try that because I'd, I'd rather sneak up on it. <laughs> okay, everybody got a fire, you got fire bottles? Yeah. Okay, ready? It's What's hot. On? It's hot. Switch off. Says off. Switch on. Hey, just FYI, this Tampier thing is backwards. Ten is idle. It should be zero pointing towards me, and ten should be forward. And the way this got installed is ten is backwards. Oh, I blame your airframe guys for that. Yeah, okay. It's hot. <laughs> All right. That's the airframe guy. <laughs> It's off. Off. Make it hot. It's hot. Off. It's off. Okay. Hot. <laughs> hot. Hot. Off. It's off. It wants to spark. You can fuel. Oh, it is. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's good to know then. Well, hot. Let, wait. Wait till it quits peaking fuel. Well, anyway, we know how to get fuel to it. Mm -hmm. That's streaming again. Yeah, okay. What is that tube connected? Does that go to the center tube? That looks like that's about where we go. Yeah, you just got to make sure we don't have a lot of fuel on the ground, too, because remember the Fokker. Yes, it's running out at a pretty good rate right now. Yeah, okay. It's like a mixture. I'll do that again. Okay, everybody's ready on the bottles. All right, it's hot. Hot. Off. Off. Make it hot. It's hot. Still hot. It's off. Spinning nice. There's no compression in it. <laughs> Make it hot. It's hot. It's off. Fuel coming out of it again. This is? I'm not touching it. I haven't touched the fuel you yet. You just notice it like kind of comes and goes. Yeah, it's like a drip, 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 drip. Huh. Andy, you've got your flashlight. Let's just take a peek real quick in here. Just peek in here. Just make sure push the, push the tampier valve o open, can it? Okay, the fuel? Yeah. yeah, the needle valve. Yeah, okay, that is, if, if the quadrant's on backwards, pushing it forward is opening it. Yeah, yeah. So well, well, actually, I'm looking at this, and it's just weird because the, because the way it's written, the 10 is closest to me, right. but it's not turned around, it's facing me. Hmm. Which I've never seen before. I, th I always thought it was the other way yeah. around. But it, it's it's intuitively correct when you push it up. Yeah. It, it's yeah, open. Yeah. And you quit dripping. Yeah. yeah. All right, it's hot. It's off. Off. Hot. Hot. Off. You want to try to and some fuel there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's do that, because yeah, I swear that's what I use. Might be in the like that. Okay, hold it there. Yeah, that one I can. Okay, come around two. That sounded that good. Sounded it's off. Off. Ready? Make it hot. It's hot. Okay, can I go home now? Huh? <laughs> and he wants to go home. He, he thinks his job is done. The guarantee, warranty's out. Yeah, the warranty's <laughs> done. <laughs> that was 10 seconds. <laughs> so anyway, so I, I pushed it forward. And I was I was pushing on the blip switch on the stick right. to check it, and it didn't seem like it was working. Do you, do you want to check that before you go any further, or 
Do you want to start it again, or what do you want to do? Well, I can run it off the yeah. one mag if I have to. Well, there is only one mag. No, but I can run it off the other switch at one switch right, if I have to. Right, right, right. Unless one's hot and the other, if one's off and the other one's still hot. But we got the tail tied down, so yeah, if it's 800 right. RPM is all we're going to get. Right. All right. So we, all right. Everything's we do, off. We'll do that whole exercise again then. Did you get all the cylinders or just... No, it, I remember it now. It's just the same as the snipe. What you have to do is you have to get each alternate cylinder yes. off the, yeah, the cutout. So he goes round two, I squirt. He goes round two, I squirt. So you can't... Unless you go all the way around twice. Yeah. But I don't think you need to do that. I think, it, I mean, that fired up quite Yeah, happy, yeah, so you're right, you're right, okay. So. And, uh, and, uh, and, uh, no, you don't need me to keep telling you that. <laughs> That's That's pretty pretty one, two more for that. It's the right, it's the rhythm. Yeah. Getting out of your way. Same as you like. Still off. Ready? Yeah, make it hot. It's hot. Still hot. <laughs> All right. I don't know what happened. I had the. Uh, I had plenty of fuel, plenty of air. Uh, Switches were where they should have been. Well, it's obviously not pulled in fuel. I mean, that was just prime it was running on there. Yeah. So, uh, so now I just you got to do it again, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that was. That Says was off. Yeah. <laughs> it used to be able to. You could idle it back to 800 RPM, and then below that it would just quit. So maybe I'm just. Maybe I haven't got it up far enough forward yet. Right. And then you blip it with a switch below 800. You set it for where it quits, just above where it quits, and then you just blip it. But I just want to make sure this master switch on the panel works as well, so I can well, check. I can check that for you. Okay. Hot. It's hot. It's off. Hot. It's hot. That's a lot of fuel. I mean, it was two thirds of the way forward. Well, it's running longer, so let me just go full throttle and see what happens. Well, it's got a little bit more compression to it. Yeah. Oh, something nasty. So where do you want it? Uh, I'm working on it. I don't like it. That's good. Okay, I'm going all the way forward, so uh, it's it's hot. Here we go. I don't know what the problem is. All right. Cool. So I was leading with the air valve. And what was happening was it probably it was allow wasn't allowing the fuel to suck up in there. Okay. So 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 let's try that. So right I'm mean, not flown one of these at. things in freaking forever. Right into it. Yeah, it has the grease fitting. I thought that was the one for a long time. It's just frozen. Well, it's only been ten years. Yeah. Okay. Probably. Are you ready? No, hold on. He's coming alive now. I know. He's yeah. got some compression. He's got some compression. Okay, switch on. Okay, our fuel's on. I'm going to lead with the fuel this time. It's hot. Still hot. Uh, switch off. Switch off. Switch on. Hot. That was worth a try. Yep. All right. That didn't work. Control. The fuel metering system is very primitive. Well, there's essentially, you've got basically one lever lets X amount of air in, depending on its position, and the other lets X amount of fuel in. Switch off, fuel off. Kermit's thought was that 
perhaps that he'd been putting too much air into the engine in the first instance and not letting enough fuel in. In other words, a weak, situ a weak mixture situation. Um, sadly, not the case. So, for some reason, it's not sucking. But we'll, um, you know, I'm happy enough that it made noise and didn't fly apart. So, you know, a little self-confidence. We'll fix it tomorrow. All right. Well, we made some noise. All right, I'm not as young as I used to be, and I can't remember how to get out of it. Yeah, I was close. It's not an easy thing to get out of. <laughs> yeah, once I figure out where it is, I'll get it. <coughs> All right, well. Satisfactory. <laughs> well, at least it was started to run. But it didn't look too hard to start either, not doing that. No, so, no, so I'm wondering, I just wonder why it's not getting... Uh... We'll, we'll work it out. Well, that didn't work. It's all right, we're fine. Anytime this week. Okay, now. Slow. You got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. We got it. Okay. There was a couple little things that I thought were done that weren't done. Anyway, we had to wire the blip switch. Uh, we had to uh, make a little bit of an adjustment on the quadrant for the tampier valve. And the, uh, the, the fuel valve was basically not shutting the fuel off. So even when I would shut the, the tampier valve off, was like a little tapered needle valve and close it, it was still dripping fuel, so Andy had to take it apart and clean it out. But anyway, it's, it's working fine now, so we'll see how it goes. If you just pull the motor through a few times, it'll suck a few days. Y'all ready? Okay. Switch is off. Uh, switch that is off, blip switch is off. I got the, uh, the fuel is on. Oh yeah, it's totally gonna work. <laughs> Worry, but. I'm gonna give it a little bit of fuel just to ready. Valves are hot. The leaking? Damn it. Yes. Okay. It's pouring out. Ow. All right. Damn. And a quick. For the stick. That will have Thank you. Switch is off. Uh, switch says off. Make it hot. She's hot. Still hot. Oh, it's uh -huh. off. Hey, hot. Hot. Fuel's off. Yeah, so I'm getting about, the, the prop's about right because I'm getting about at full throttle, you know, not moving. I'm getting about 
1100 RPM. So once I start moving, it'll it'll get going. And as long as I'm climbing, I keep the speed down, it should be good. It's just hard to see. You gotta look around the, the uh, gun protector here, butt thing. But uh, anyway, it's good. Yeah, it's, uh, did a mag check, obviously. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> On both uh, the blip switch as well as the master switch. Well, we just got to work on some paperwork. Good. We're getting there. We're making progress. Hopefully headed towards Oshkosh. Yeah, I think we do that. <laughs>